Amazing. I knew you'd understand. Hi, Willie. You here to take me into custody? Please, let me explain that note. You don't have to. I understand. I'm just sensitive because I am guilty. Guilty of what? I'm guilty of being a terrible daughter. I've been a jerk to my dad all year. And now I might never... I might never talk to him again. Anything I can do to help? Well, actually, there is something I need. Just name it. There is a very special fungus that only grows in damp parts of the questionable area. Say no more. I'm on it. Thanks, Raz. Looks like this is where Lily comes to work out some of her darker thoughts. I'm just going to pluck this one leaf.
against you. This is amazing. Coach was trying to throw it out, but I knew it was fixable. With this transmitter, KLOB will finally be on the air. Wow. No, KLOB. We enrobe the mother load with music. Cool. So where are your records? Well, oh. I only have one right now. What? Hey, we gotta start somewhere. If I find any, I'll bring you one. I'm counting, partner. Let's say supportive free agent, okay? Anyway, our fans come for the music, but they stay for the personalities. Like who? Like me. Huh. And you? Hey, guys. Ugh, busted. Now we gotta burn this site and find a new base of operations. What? Pirate radio, Gisu. Gotta be ready to bug out in 30 seconds flat if you feel the heat around the corner. Relax, Morris. I'm not a narc. Exactly what a narc would say. Where'd you get the radio? Gisu fixed up Coach's old transmitter and made it more powerful. Just be careful you don't fall asleep on that thing and broadcast your dreams out to the world. Who would ever be dumb enough to do that? Meh. Do you know where the psycho-isolation chamber is? Ooh, are you trying to steal Lizzie's mentor, Compton Bull? No. So you're happy with Nick from the mailroom? Of course. Everybody loves Nick. So why a radio station, Morris? Shouldn't you be working with Mia? Mia wants me to learn how to reach out into the world. And this is how I'm going to do it. With radio. Have you told her about this yet? No. I'm waiting until we get back our first ratings report so I can show her how effective it is. Okay. I need to go report my findings to the radio police. Ha-ha. <laughs> hey, Gisu. Rasputin Aquato, say, you seem like the reckless and resourceful type. I have a challenge that I think is perfect for a young man of your disposition. Interested? Whatever it is, I'm into it. Wow, even more reckless than I thought. Impressive. Here's the issue. My mentor, Otto Mentalis, deployed several psycho seismometers like this one to detect and collect negative psychic residue. Problem is, he kind of forgot about them for a long time. So now, they're all overloaded and unstable. I thought, instead of me going around venting all these nasty things and stealing all the glory... You want me to do it? For extra credit. You're welcome. And to free me up for more high-minded engineering work. Okay. Come on, rep. Wait. You said yes? Alright, good man! <laughs> well, if you survive, be sure to report back, okay? looking for something. What was it? Oh, right! A brain for Nick! So I can get into C4, and to keep Nick from getting his head caught in the stamper again.
what you did! What the hell is up, Sean? What is sheepy shipping? And sheepy shapping? Sheepy shapping is general chicanery. Wheeling and dealing. waiting for someone to come visit for a long time. I can tell. I was starting to think I was invisible. <laughs> you ever get that feeling? Well, there was this one girl who looked kind of like a blue scarecrow. But she scared me. <gasps> but you seem nice. So did I guess your name right? It's Raz. Oh, that was the very next name I was going to say, I swear. You didn't say any. So, name. how long are you committing yourself for? Oh. Committing myself to what? Psycho isolation, silly. We don't commit people anymore without their consent, unless they're a danger to themselves or others. How many people you got in there? Oh, just Agent Rule right now. He likes it in there. Keeps him from feeling overwhelmed by all the you-know-what in the woods. Ghosts? Voices. He can't shut them out. Can you believe he even finds so yes, me ghosts. overwhelming? <laughs> oh, who would ever think that? So anyway, I've got a nice room ready man, for you. You the man, man! Actually, Jesus. I like you, man! I like you a lot! Well, okay. Thank you for the sub, Just man. Be Jesus. Careful. Don't ask him Popping too subs out of nowhere. Or he'll curl up into a little ball and something might explode. Hi! It's it's kind of funny that my uh, follow notification is Hi. fucking Invader Zim and Raz Ooh, is, this a hint? is Invader Zim. I don't get it. Hmm. I see what you're doing there. Hmm. Oh, you think you're clever, don't you? Looks like there's a senior league membership card stuck in this frame. Hey, don't even look at that. It's private. Agent Bull? Huh? This guy has, uh, problems. Hi, I'm Rasputin. I'm a friend of your grandson. Oh no, he hasn't hurt anybody else, has he? No, no, no. No humans. My, and my, I uh, good. My good. follow, uh, alert. Like when someone follows me, is Invader Zim, but my sub sub notification is uh, Rosso, uh, Porco Rosso, smoking a cigarette at a bar. Do you need help getting out of there? No, I put myself in here. And then when I get raided, it's fucking Big Boss. 
And then when I, uh... And I have a lot of shit. I see Lizzie introduced you to Harold. Oh no. Harry Kasparov here showed up on his own. So why is rant. Lizzie still out there looking for animals? Oh, well, I mostly sent her away just because there's too many voices in here. Hint, hint. He's telling me to get the fuck out of here. Why did you put yourself in there? Well, I was feeling a little overwhelmed. And when I get overwhelmed, accidents happen. Agent Poole, I need your help. Oh, no. With what? I need help catching the mole in the Psychonauts. Sorry, don't do moles. They're little snuts. Give me the heebie-jeebies. No, I mean there's a counter-spy in the organization. Oh, well, I'm retired from spy work. A danger to myself and to others, they say. Who would say that? Me. I need help fighting Maligula. Ah, you need to warn a gentleman before slapping him in the face with a name like that. She's long gone, but the scars are still painful. Someone's trying to bring Maligula back. Ah! Well, I, I suppose I had enough warning that time. Listen, Maligula is dead and gone. Even if she were to return, I was no help fighting her the first time. I'll be sitting out any future Maligula battles for everyone's protection. Everyone's protection. Never mind. I don't need it. Shit. Agent Bull? Huh? Agent Bull? God damn it. I need your help. Oh no. With what? I need a senior league membership card. What? Well, don't look at mine. Please, Agent Bull. It's important. That bowling card is a precious memento of a dear friend. Oh, I'm sorry. Did she die? No, no, she's somewhere. Out in the forest. What? Well, let's go find her. Well, I've tried for years, but I just can't anymore. Please let me borrow your senior league membership card. No, now buzz off. <laughs> Bus off. Hey, hang on a second. Exactly what I was thinking, Harold. The bees could help. Cassie and I always loved working with bees in the forest. If you could bring me just one bee, I'll bet I could talk to it and find out where my Cassie is. No kidding? Here, yeah, take this and hurry. Okay, one bee coming up. Okay, I'm off to the forgetful forest to find a bee for Agent Fool. This is a serious mission, no matter how adorable it sounds. Scanning for thinker print. Access granted. Ow! Oops! Ah. Sorry, little brother. I thought you were a rabid squirrel. Knock it off, crazy! <laughs> Not for little kids. <laughs> okay. You never played the first one, dude? Holy shit. Fuck yeah, it's good. Doesn't look like a death trap to me. The first one was kinda for 
kids, I guess you would say. Not really for kids. Kids would be fine playing it. This one is not really for kids. This is for like teenagers and older because it deals with very difficult mental themes for some people. Multiple personality disorders, mental disorders, shit like that. And it might turn some people off to it. Is that cheating? These machines are more work than I expected, but it looks more stable now. Guess this mine is really dangerous. For skeletons. Interesting mushroom, but Lily said to look for a very special fungus in the damp parts of the questionable area. Not you. Oh, uh, Jack Black's in this. Card. This does a musical bit. is not a panda, which is shocking because he's been a panda for like 40 years now. you baby ow that was a rock i'm warning you <laughs> oh 
welcome to the questionable area. Oh, shit, not yet. These are the mines to the questionable area. Now we're in the classroom. Area. Looks like the Aquato family circus has traveled through. That here. is his sister, yes. Yep, we had to hightail it out into the woods because you're ashamed of being an Aquato. I'll stop being ashamed of that. If you stop being ashamed of being a psychic. <laughs> oh, you're asking for it, Raspy. Crazy, it's okay. You can tell Dad now. You don't have to hide anymore. <sighs> this is your last warning. Crazy? <sighs> Ow! More where that came from. I think the entrance to the forgetful forest is somewhere here in the questionable area. Yeah, it is, but uh I gotta go talk to a fucking lady who's mental as shit real quick. I'll take that card. You don't get it. Look at this. Oh, for Lancelot, thank you. Are those the acorns I asked for? Yes? No. No, they can't be, can they? No, because I asked for acorns that were crushed, didn't I? Didn't I, for Lancelot? I hate to yell at you, for Lancelot, but I. I am the crushed one. It crushes my heart to see you not doing your best. Understand? Now, do I need to show you how to crush things? No? You sure? Okay. Good boy. Now, try again. But this time, think about personal commitment and delivering excellence every day. All right? Sorry you had to see that, Raz. <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh. Can't leave this card lying around. Hey, Sam. Talk fast. Cakes are cooking. I have some questions about pancakes. <laughs> Start flapping, Jack. Why didn't you just go order some pancakes at the cafeteria? Agent Oleander didn't give me any money. I assumed to test my resourcefulness. What's your recipe? Just the basics, you know, eggs, milk, flour. Found most of it here, with a couple quick substitutions. What sort of substitutions? If I told you, it would compromise the perceived flavor profile. Isn't that just straight up dirt? <laughs> for the umami. Uh. Yeah. Yep. That sounds like one of my old bosses, too. Weren't all the supplies here kind of old? Look, you can't take the expiration dates too seriously. They're just the food industry protecting itself from lawsuits. And protecting us from, like... Food poisoning? Psst. No one's getting sick from my pancakes. Cause they ain't no one Unless fucking one of you jerks them. didn't wash their hands. Eh, better late than never. Yeah, that's where you got Where'd the milk. Where'd you get the milk? <laughs> oh, yeah, that would have been easier. Uh. Hey, you brought us closer, Fran. Oh. Uh, oh, God. You used eggs you found here? Old eggs? No. Folks, I found some fresh ones. And you know, 
can use enough syrup, you can't tell chicken from snake. Eggs is eggs. Oh my god. Can I have a pancake? You can have any that fall on the floor. Thanks. Where'd you learn how to make pancakes? Prison. <laughs> Wait, what did I say? I meant from my mother. <laughs> I'm out of pancake questions. <laughs> Good, because I'm out of pancake puns. Oh, God damn it. What are you doing out here? Well, you know my intern mentor, Coach Morso Oleander? Uh, yeah. Well, this is the first assignment he gave me. Mission. Get me some pancakes so I can think. I think it's supposed to teach me something about the many layers of the mind. Yeah, that you're a yeah. gopher. I know the butter stands for lateral thinking. I got that much. Oh my god. Can I ask you about your family? Why? Because my last name is Bull, and because that's a famous family in the Psy community, and you want to network with me to further your Psy career? Go for it. Jesus. I'm a friend of your brother's. Hmm. Your head looks remarkably unexploded. It must be the helmet. Has your brother Dogen really made someone's head explode? No, never. Wait, you mean someone who didn't deserve it? No. I mean, like, anybody. Look, whole body's perfect. <laughs> Am I right? Jesus Christ. Can everyone in the pool family talk to animals? Most of us can talk to them. Uh, but I usually of us really know how to listen. Well, not to usually. Animals. I can no? if I want. For instance, I just don't I want to move my all my shit in the other room with my green screens. Mrs. Thatcher. So that's why I got my little emblem spinning in the corner. What can you tell me about Compton? Mm, Gramps is nice and all, but honestly, he's a little weird. <laughs> No, still too tough. What? Ugh, oh my fucking god. Okay, I'll stop asking about your family. The bull's got nothing to hide, unlike some of these squirrels. Relax, I'm talking about your nuts. You guys still hide nuts, right? <laughs> guys, learn to laugh a little, okay? You'll live longer. So... You always wanted to be a psychonaut, too? Uh, not really. My true dream is to be a pet therapist. Because I'm really good with animals. Yeah, right sure. Now? Are you worried about Maligula? Raz, Maligula's ancient history. My grandpa killed her by triggering an elephant stampede. Yeah. What? Uh, I never heard huh. about it. You believe the official story, do you? I gotta go. Yeah. Catch you on the flip side. Yes, it is funny every time. <laughs> All right, time to deal with the horrible horribleness that is my own family. I'm kidding. They're just also gypsies. Psychar. They're raspy. They're in the campgrounds. Yeah, well, too bad. Ooh, a funicular. I mean, who doesn't love those? Don't even think about getting on that funicular before you visit your family. That's exactly what I'm going to do. Looks like there's just one more part to find. Kids today. Aha. I think it's not running right now. God damn it. Ha! Got a 
gotta put a little more fun in that funicular. That pun is just one of the things I love about funicular. Whee! Here we go! Oh my god, this thing is going so fast in my throat from motion sickness. Funicular! What was I doing out here again? Oh, right. So, I mean, in their defense, they're not called fasting killers. Yeah. Oh. Ambush. You crazy? Raz, why haven't you gone to see Mom yet? I'm scared. You should be. The whole family hates you now, but they have the right to tell you that to your face. Okay, <laughs> I'll go right now. Good. Then come back here so I can make you feel bad too. <sighs> Man, does this hurt on a personal level. Jerk! Every day with her could be our last! Go see Mom in the campgrounds! She's worried sick about you! Got a side card. Oh. Oopsie! Children never ran away from home. Where would the circus get her workers, huh? Uh. What matters is that the Aquatos are all together again. Wow. This little adventure of yours has actually given me fresh inspiration for our act. Me too. Did you see that unnatural and slightly gimmicky waterfall over there? Me not. The what cool upside shit ever. down? Stay away from it. No water. Too late, Nona. It has already watered the flower of inspiration in my heart and blossomed in two. Guess what I called it? Guess. The upside down waterfall? The devil's fire hose. Let's show our runaway how we do it, everybody. Creepy on the bottom. This would be easier if you didn't use so much hair grease. It'd be easier if your head weren't so pointy. Now, Rasputin, up top you go. Yes, son. And then you could add a little psychic flourish by levitating this pine cone. No, no. Then we pass each person up the tower like water flowing. No psychic flourishes. I told you. We. Oui. Our acrobats. We don't do parlor tricks. Uh, guys? Why not a little of both? Pops? Oh, pretty. You guys? Oh, shush. 
This is why we taught you how to fall as babies. Hmm. It's no use. We need the aquaphorone. <laughs> I'm on it. Help him out, would you, Booty? He's had to take on so much extra work since you abandoned your family and broke our hearts. That's a good boy. God damn. If there's one thing the Aquatos know how to do, it's making themselves at home. Anywhere. There's the gypsy music. Hey, Mom. Oh, yes, Rasputin? What you doing? I'm trying to perfect the devil's fire hose, of course. It's a risky one, but I think this might be the spectacle that puts the Aquatos back on top. Can I help? Yes. Tell me how to make the devil's fire hose reach even greater heights. <laughs> how about some sight- Finish that sentence and it will kill your mother, Rasputin. <laughs> Maybe if everyone stood on tippy toes? Everyone is already stretched to their full height. I should know. I stretch them every day. What if we incorporate animals into the act? Overall, children are cheaper and slightly cleaner. What if we set everyone's costumes on fire? Very exciting. But these are the only costumes we have, Rasputin. Seems like doing the trick horizontally would be safer. Safety doesn't fill seats, Rasputin. What if everyone were singing? Ugh, I'd rather die in water. I agree. Blindfolds? We tried that before. Remember the big pink eye epidemic? Shut us down for a week. Chainsaws? Who will pay for the gasoline, darling? Well, that's all the ideas I got. Sorry. Hmm. You really want to help me? Go find your brother, Queepy. He's wandered off again. Top of what? Top of the acrobatic world, Rasputin. As the Aquatos once were before the curse. Can I ask you about the curse? Not too loud. You know your father doesn't like to talk about it. But as you know, a cruel fortune teller cursed our family, Raz. Every Aquato for all time is cursed to die in water. That is why we had to leave our grand aquatic circus behind and start again at the bottom in this humble family troop. We may not have water anymore, but we still have the most important thing, right? We still have family. highly stretchable ligaments. Oh, yes, and family. <laughs> Who cursed us? Too many questions. Stay away from the water! <laughs> I stopped arguing with that woman long ago. You know, Agent Foresight is a very important psychonaut. And she's really cool, actually. She's kind of I a bitch. I think you really like each other now. The woman in the suit? Uh, we get along just fine. As long as we keep our distance. A circus can only have one prima donna. Sorry about running away. It's okay, Rasputin. I blame myself. Really? Why? I forgot to latch your door that night. You... you <laughs> latch our door at night? From the outside? Only since Queepy started sleepwalking. Okay, I'm going to go practice my acrobatics. Uh-huh. Remember, every time you lie, it takes a day off your mother's life. Jesus Christ. Nice trick, Tala. Is Nona looking? Yes. And she looks really impressed. <laughs> Hi, Nona. Oh, hello, my sweet little turnip. Are you comfortable? Do you need anything? I'm happy as long as I'm with my family. Aren't you cold out here in the woods? Ugh, please. I'm from Brulovia. This is nothing. Can I ask you about the curse? No. Oh, near the water. Yes, I know about that part, but then you know the whole thing. <laughs> oh, you need the <laughs> Do you hate psychics as much as mom? You mean fortune tellers? Like the galonkios? 
of Anzukarstas. They are not natural. They are not trustworthy. Nona, who's your favorite grandchild? It's me, right? Oh, of course, you are my favorite. My sweet little Dion. Oof. Well, I gotta go back to my spy stuff. Good boy. Now don't get that big head. Too late. Morris Martinez, and you're listening to KLOB, the heartbeat of the mother load. Creepy, there you are. Aw, oh, man, you found my perfect dancing place. Sorry. Too late. You ruined it. Uh, Mom's looking for you. You little dick. Hi, son. Think I'm getting any better at this? Press harder on your temples. Really? I'm already getting a bit of a bruise there. Just keep practicing. That's it? Clear your mind. If it were any emptier, I'd pass out. Focus on the hottest thing you can think of. Okay, then. I'm thinking of your mother. Dad! We're human beings, Rasputin. You're really taking to this psychic stuff. Like, really hard. Well, I guess I'm making up for lost time. Plus, it could be a fun father and son activity for us to do together, don't you think? Uh-huh. Dad, can I ask you about where we come from? You mean, Glovia. That's a sad story, son. But there were some glory days back in the old country. The Aquatos were part of a very prestigious national circus there. We even perform for the Tsar and his family from time to time. But then that monster Maligula ruined everything. Actually, Maligula's not ancient history. Some of her followers are trying to bring her back to life. What? The Psychonauts think one of her delusionists have infiltrated the base as a mole. Then be careful what you tell them, son. They're more connected to Maligula. Than you should say. What's that? What do you mean we're connected to Maligula? She comes from the Galocchio family. The family that cursed all of our family to die in water? Son, she is the Galocchio who cursed our family to die in water. And it worked. My father drowned in the Valermo Dam disaster. But my mother, your Nona, Survived. <coughs> she escaped Malovia and came here to get away from the curse. What do you think of the Devil's Fire Hose? Oh, it's going to be a showstopper, I can tell. Your mother never disappoints, you know. I just wish she'd let me add a little, you know, razzle dazzle. Oh, yes, like that. Thanks for helping out back at summer camp. Well, I could tell somehow you were in trouble. Probably because of our psychic connection. So, how is Lily? I couldn't help but notice when I was inside your mind... Dad! ...that you had some uncertainty about the status of your relationship. What's that? Just tell her how you feel, son. Tell us all how you feel, Raz. <sighs> I don't think Mom's on board with this psychic stuff. Oh, she'll get used to it. 
like she did with my model train, Harvey. <sighs> Still so sad about how that elephant sat on my whole collection. Dad, our <laughs> circus doesn't have any elephants. Hmm, true. Not sure where that animal came from. I'll have to ask your mother. She's the one who saw it happen. You know who else in the family is psychic, right? Does it rhyme with Daisy? Yes, and also with Lazy. Well, if that's true, then it's for her to tell us about son, not you. <sighs> yeah, I guess you're right. <laughs> I had that coming. I'll let you get back to practicing. Yes, yes. I think I'm almost there. <laughs> hey, I found some of the scavenger. Mission critical. <laughs> Did you see that? How could I not? It caught fire! A little. Mr. Aquato, you almost started a forest fire just then. Well, I don't know about that. I do. You had me really scared. <laughs> Progress. Man, this part of the woods. Look at this Tim Burton and shit. Crazy? I know it's you. I'm not stupid. <laughs> <gasps> Crud, it's you. I thought I finally caught a critter. Why are you hunting? Aren't they feeding you? <laughs> I'm interning with Compton Bull. He sent me out here to catch him some animals. I really don't know if you should be bringing animals to Agent Bull. His grandson is a friend of mine, but that family can be a little bit rough on animals. Oh? And you've never side blasted a squirrel, nature yes, boy? Indeed, uh, Canada. That's what I thought. Anyway, it's no use. I'd have to go deeper into the forgetful forest no, for any really good it's not animals. Dexter, it's Invader Zim. There's no way I'm going in there. Why? Telekinetic bears? <gasps> Has nobody told you? About the green needle witch who haunts these woods? Her mother was a banshee, and her father was a porcupine. Let me guess. She hates children and kills them on sight. No, she loves children. She follows them through the forest, and when she catches them, she gives them a big hug. That doesn't sound so... Impaling them on her needles, filling them with holes. Okay, if you could the just let me down now... The dude who voices Gur is also in this. She's there, she's there. The Green Needle Witch has waited. She wants a hug. Don't dare, don't dare, or soon you'll be perforated. <laughs> I'm getting a strong psychic sense that Lizzie and Norma are sisters. Sibling detection is one of the less celebrated tools of the Psychonauts playbook. The kind they don't get badges for. Looks like a great place to get those bees for Compton. Okay, I'm just going to take one of you on a little trip to see an old friend. Ooh, I got three. Even better. Not so fast. Run. Lizzie?
got that thing set again. The Green Needle Witch! Where? Th that way! That way! Ugh, poor city kid. Do yourself a favor and stay indoors where it's safe. Phew, okay. Better get these bees back to Compton so we can find his friend. And so I can get that senior league pass. Don't worry about helping out, Squirt. We're used to getting by without you. Shut up, you dick. Hey, Dion. Mm-hmm. Mom told me you needed help. With what? Reading crystal balls? Beat it, Nostra dumbass. Looks like you need someone to release the ropes. I'll just pop up there and take care of it. Oh, really, Mr. Mental? You think you even remember how to be an acrobat? You'll see. You sure look like you could use some help. You look like you could use a tailor. <laughs> you sure you're using the right knots on those support ropes? I don't know. Why don't you come a little closer so I can practice my knots on you? Look, Dion. I know you're mad about me running away. Don't flatter yourself. If you hadn't stolen Frazy's horse, we wouldn't have even noticed you were gone. Hey, I sent Sugar Q back home as soon as I got to the train tracks. Poor little thing was exhausted. Not Sugar Next Q. Next time you run away, instead of taking the world's smallest pony, call a cab. You'll get farther. Maybe we won't be able to find you. Don't you think it's time to get over your anti-psychic stuff? I will when it stops hurting our family. Dad's a psychic. It's a phase. Frazy's a psychic. Oh, that's a great example. Yeah, we should all be more like Frazy. Ow! Ah. You wish you could be more like me. <laughs> How long are you planning on being mad like this? Forever. Can realize what you've done to the Aquato name? Psychics? Fortune tellers? You let out our family's worst secret. This family has too many secrets. We'll be better off when they're all out. We'll be better off when you're out. Dion. Bye, Dion. Okay, so that creepy mind stuff did save a little time. But I still don't have to like it. Deal. And you're welcome! Seeing the old Aquato Dome again reminds me of a trick Dion taught me once.
this man's brain is very damaged. Agent Bull? I got some visitors here who are really excited to. Ah! I said one! I only needed one B! Shoo! Shoo! Get out of here! I got extra. They seem friendly. Oh no! Don't all talk at once, please! I can't take it! I can't! It's too much! Too much! Oh no! Don't explode! And don't explode me! Agent Bull? Ah! What's wrong? Too many voices. Too many everything. Want me to kill those beads? No! Like with fire, maybe. It's totally not a problem. Please, don't hurt them. Would you mind if I made a quick and very quiet, uh, wellness check? Inside your mind? Yeah, you uh, definitely need one. Scream once for yes, I may enter your mind, and twice for no. Uh, Great. Out of my way, bees. I'm not ready. Cassie's not here. Not ready for what? Dinner. Uh-oh. Let me guess. We're on the menu? No. Worse. Judgment. Court is in session. Please remain standing. If you're able. Is that a challenge, motherfucker? Let's take a five minute recess. But this, it's time for Ram It Down! <laughs> this part is fucked up. Good evening, and welcome to Ram It Down. I'm your host, Tin Can Zanotto, and tonight, We'll watch one lucky contestant prepare three increasingly complicated dishes in an attempt to please our celebrity judges. Impossible! He'll never do it. He's nothing without Cassie. <laughs> and he's the nice one. <laughs> well, let's get to our first dish. A tragic delicacy from a troubled nation. A Grulovian drowned egg. Ooh. First, our contestant will have to find a very outspoken egg. Ooh, me! Pick me! Boil it in hot water. I'm all fired up and ready to go. Prepare it with an unruly onion. He said my name! That's been sliced into pieces. Just call me or Stopper. Put them both together on a plate and see if the judges can bear two... Finish your dish before the clock runs out, and you'll win valuable prizes from the Mystery Box! What do you say? Think you're up to the challenge? Sounds easy. We got this. Right, partner? Partner? What did you expect, Raz? Yeah, 
What was I expecting? Ship has the egg. <gasps> it's happening! <laughs> Let's see if he remembers what to do with it. No, there's Goku. Don't have a stupid chicken. Well, don't just sit there resting on your boils. We've got other ingredients to prepare. Ooh, this is a bad time for watermelon, folks. You I'm ready for the knife! Did we make it? I... I'm not sure. We'll find out. Eat, 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 well, here eat, we are. At the moment eat, of truth. Eat, eat, Will we be looking eat, at a drowned egg? Eat, or a drowned eat, contestant? Eat, 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 eat. Reveal! The meal! <gasps> so, what we did was, we took an egg. Boring. And we popped it into the water. Pedestrian! Uh, then, uh, then Chef had the idea to uh, withhold the salt at just the right moment to create a sense of, uh, longing within the <laughs> milk, if you will. You what? We think it really improves the nose feel of the composition. Hmm, compelling. Bone appetite. <laughs> yes, mine do too. <laughs> Surprisingly acceptable. Surprisingly acceptable! And that's not all. By finishing within the time limit, You've opened the mystery box! The mystery box! Half a mind. Well, don't just stand there resting on your laurels. That one was a gimme. Let's see how you do on your next dish. Shoot! Congratulations! You did it! How does it feel? Um, well... Fantastic! Well, <laughs> get ready, because it's time for your next dish! Right after this commercial message. I can really use 
Damn it. So before I push that button and start the next dish, let's take a breather, okay? Good idea. Oh. I think I hear some emotional baggage. Suitcase tag. That's what I need. Big bad. They fucking failed horribly. Somebody died. And she left. And he broke. some emotional baggage here. wanted the help. He broke into an animal shelter and let all these animals out, but he got overwhelmed by all their voices in his head, and he vaporized all of them. It gets even worse, so uh, here we go. See, Agent Bull? You can do it. Next one won't be so easy. You got that right. For your next dish, you'll be creating a strawberry jam croque madame. Ooh, la, la. You'll need to boil another egg. <laughs> easy. Take some bread. I've already risen to the occasion. Slice it up. Bread's much nicer once it's been through the slice. And fry it up on the griddle. I'm getting ready to rip it flip out. Uh, well, what about the strawberry, huh? Hey! <laughs> Glad you asked. 
We'll need not just any strawberry, but a strawberry that's been blended. Did yeah. someone call for patty puree? All right, monsieur. It's time to show us your best madame. I wonder which ingredient he'll select first. Ah, you won't be disappointed. Just needs to blend that strawberry. Right now, ah. here's a choking hazard. Careful, I lost an arm oh, there once. Once I can taste human flesh, oh, it changes the relationship. I'm lighter than I look, right? Right? Ever heard the expression? Place the ingredient. Will he be able to pull back the pork chopper's action hoof? Action hoof. Great! Once he pushes that button, the chopping begins. Now clear. You need to fry? I'm your guy. <laughs> Sir, I'm gonna need you not give in to their buns. Played it. Should have the, the fucking egg and the bread. Oh well, I still got plenty of time. Come on, hurry up, back. All right, egg's done. I said the egg is done. Say for yourself. We have uh, attempted to infuse this dish with um... curiosity and resilience. <laughs> the more sensitive palates among you will also discern just a dash of regret. <laughs> <laughs> Slightly better than a mouthful of nails. Slightly better than a mouthful of nails. That's not all. By finishing within the time limit, you've opened the mystery box! Yes, our container. Now, be gone! And bring us more food! Well, you two must be feeling great after producing such a quality product for our judges. And speaking of quality products, it's time for a word from one of our sponsors.
<laughs> oh, I'm playing this on Steam. And uh, I have it on uh, capped at 60 FPS. Just because. I don't want to have any screen tearing problems when I'm streaming. Like, I don't have any problems playing this. I just don't know if it will cause any tearing or so not. This is a quarter. Let's see how you fucking infinite judge. Thank you for helping me, young man. I don't know what I'd do without you. How would you feel about taking a little break before I push that? Let me test this out real quick. Uh... Is it screen tearing or anything? Smash that button and get cooking again. Yep. Yeah, I get what you're saying. The game is... You, you don't even know yet. Yeah, there's a... An area you're like with all the colors. But... Here we go. You know, we might just get through this. Oh, I hope I didn't just jinx it. Me too. Because it's time for our third and final dish. Straight from the Lumber Stack Diner. It's the Honey Pepper Pancakes. Gotcha. Stacker, you'll need another egg. We're old friends. He boiled my dad and grandfather. Oh, that egg needs to fry. Then I'm your guy. Next, you'll need a boar. I'm just a pig, but trust me, I'm gay. Get it? Whatever, as yeah, long as that egg here, right? gets sliced. That's a little sick, man. It egg is. Fry. Wait, I gotta pull a double shift? To give our pancake stack that signature beehive look, you're going to be using an actual beehive. Woohoo, I'm all a buzz. I wish Cassie were here to handle those bees. But wait, there's more. The final touch of summery sweetness comes from a watermelon. It's about Tom. That's been chopped. Sure, I guess. Kinda of still thinking about that pig, though. And then blood. <laughs> oh, <laughs> looks like I'm the big finish. No pressure, but this is Ford Cruller's favorite dish. To mess this up would be an insult to the very heart of the Psychonauts. Yeah. So, chefs, better get cooking. Okay. Yes, it did. Hey! That wasn't 
so bad. No kidding? Well, say hi to your dad for me. Is that honey pepper ball bacon I smell? <laughs> Not yet. Now, the chef remember where the serving plate is. <laughs> that ingredient looks ready. Now. He just has to get it back to the serving plate. <laughs> Careful with that. That doesn't smell nice. Even it's left oh my. I should have done the fucking... Watermelon. That blender takes forever. I'm retarded. Jesus. Sorry, I was looking at... Get that ingredient back to the serving plate. Ah! Oh, I knew you couldn't resist me. Chef has picked a lot of water, but he needs to slice it. The ingredient in position. Now let's quickly grab the pork chopper's hook. Quick moving blades, razor sharp. I don't want to panic you, but I would say panic would not be completely inappropriate at a time like this. God damn it! Lumber stack! Lumber stack! Lumber Have stack. I mentioned that when Lumber prepared in stack. Pot, the honey pepper pancakes Lumber can produce an Lumber interesting stack. byproduct? Lumber no, stack. I didn't mention the possibility of a deadly swarm of killer bees? Ah, no. Lumber stack. Let's see what we got. Reveal! Okay, I actually recommend... Ah, meal! You're, you're gonna might get sick from this. Next. Scene. Is that the tallest stack you can manage? It's Just taller than it looks. Anyone. Because we put the literal height of the horizontality of the flavor profile, if you will. Ah! 
Moderately pleasant. Moderately pleasant. Well, Chef, it looks like you've won over not just our judges, but also our audience. How do you feel? I, uh, well, I, I, I couldn't have done it without this young man here. No way! You can totally do this on your own now, Agent Bull. No, don't say that. That's great to hear. Because it's time for... What, audience? Double Down! No! That's right. It's time to double down! Chef will be cooking alone in our isolation station, completely dependent on his sous chef to gather the ingredients he needs for the final three dishes. Don't worry, Agent Pool. I'll get you all the ingredients you need. What do you think, judges? Ready for another course? No problem. We're... Professionals. Uh, we might have to uh, uh, make a little room. Okay, first dish is vegetable medley. Ingredients on the board. I'm getting out of here before things get messy. The bosses just gave you a hint. The music's pretty Mega Man y though. To see that, I'm going to close my eyes. Perfect choice! But is it too much? I'm slightly with a vomit on this one, but I'll cover it up with spice. My kingdom for an egg! What? Oh, God. Oh, you can't scare the shit out of me. Vomit is not one of those disgusting I told the two no, I, I wouldn't touch that if I knew. God oh, damn it. Oh, finally! I don't like it in here. Oh, yes! Where are we going to get a strawberry? Oh, that's not going to help the chef's final score. <laughs> about time you found one of those. That's yeah, the final ingredient. Now I just have to make this dish all by myself. You can do it, Agent I shall certainly try. We did it! As you know, in the double down round, if you are the squeamish, chef look away. The dish to the judges. Let's see if this young man has a passion for service. Oh, it looks like our judge liked that dish. Perhaps a little too much. Oh, but it looks like someone's ready to get back in the mix. That's ah, gonna be messy. I'm out of here. Second dish is Royal Borscht. Good luck. <laughs> oh, please tell me this batch has the ingredients in it. Oh no, he's got the wrong ingredient again. Eat this. No! It's not like he's got a good one, relatively speaking. Just clear 
your mind. Uh. Quickly, uh. 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 and please uh. 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 Oh, that's great! Yeah, piggy piggy! I'm glad I always keep beats in my pockets for occasions like this. You need to serve the judges, Chef, not attack them. Just need to focus. More I wouldn't touch that. Oops. Wrong ingredient. Put that down. You'll spoil the dish. I don't want this. Mm. No offense. Oh, oh, here we go. Come on. I know you go take some eggs or... Lucretia taught me how to make borscht ones. I think I remember the recipe. <laughs> Please tell me this batch has the ingredients in the wood. Rats! This is what I'm attacking the judges. It seems like the sous chef has picked up the wrong mm. ingredient. Wrong. My god. That's better. Literally the last fucking one. Hey, you gotta take it from here. Brace yourself for a hastily prepared dinner down there. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. It looks incredible, but the judges say Look away if you're squeamish. Serve it before it gets up and walks away. All right, let's see if our second judge can exercise a little more moderation. Uh-oh, someone's been over-served. <laughs> and it looks like they're getting ready to slip out. But our final dish is no laughing matter. Mess up these jam tarts, and you'll find yourself in a sticky situation. <laughs> Oh, here come some fresh candidates. Quick, fresh is a strong word, but we don't need one of those right now. That's the ticket. That's just what the doctor ordered. Seeds or no seeds, it doesn't matter. Just send me a watermelon if you can. Spatula attack! <laughs> Quickly, mm -hmm. saw through that partially digested bounty and finds me in my ingredient. Nope. Ah, that's the wrong ingredient. See how the food really someone's about to get whipped. 
Why is he picking up the wrong ingredient, I wonder? Vomit is not one of the ingredients I need. Hmm. Oh, please cheer with the goat wretch for my sake. Hmm. The judges are not gonna like that. One of those disgusting lumps. Might hold the key to our victory. No. Nope. I don't want this. No offense. We don't need one of those right now. Why are you playing with that? I don't want that. Stink. Exactly what the show That's the is. last it's ingredient. Of it. I, I don't want to chase it, but eat, I feel like this one will be my best one yet. Dinner in a minute. Eat, 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 eat. eat. Let us take a <laughs> Well, who are these jammy fellows? Serve them quickly, young man. You never know what these tarts will do. <laughs> Run for the hills, folks! Oh. Well, I don't know about you, but I've certainly had my fill of excitement today. All right, everybody, let's clean up this mess. Oh. Come on, get a move on. Clean kitchen, clean mind. Ah, uh, you see, this is why I usually get takeout. <laughs> that wasn't funny. Oh, <laughs> it's so crazy. But what do you mean they won't let her out? What librarian? Hmm. Here, my boy. You've earned this. I need to go find Cassie right away. Lost? We'll never get lost. I know that forest like the back of my hand. Wait! Don't you want help? Guess he doesn't. Wait a second.
No way on him dealing. I do the wheel and I'm dealing. And what is up, Panda? Sorry, I had to find my phone charger. I left it somewhere, and I don't know what the fuck it is, so I had to find a smaller one. And grab a drink. And I am back. And yeah, how you, how, how you feeling there, Panda? one we upgraded side blast for sure can't fuck you picked a great time to fucking tune in with this senior league pass I can get to agent Fuller in the bowling alley and try to reconnect that aspect of his mind the bowling aspect Hi. Atrium. Here. Cyclops will give you an eye hope you never need it. Let's combine that Psychor with your card so you can rank up. You've never played Psychonauts? Jesus. Why have none of you played Psychonauts? Please. Go buy Psychonauts and stream it and play it. I will watch you. I will, even if I can't catch you live, I will fucking watch your recording. I don't care. It's ten dollars. It was great fucking game. I highly recommend. Got some fresh stuff over here. Brand new. Hey, Mister But that, yeah, I, that sucks when. Yeah, Visit your it's your whole sleep central auto alignment, like, fresh new oh shit, I'm tired at, you know, 2 p.m. and I pass out and I wake up at, you know, 11 p.m. or some shit. That shit sucks. Alright, where was I going? Another caviar alarm. tin in the air vent? Oh, you look just like my nephew. Okay, so if you've never played a Psychonauts game, I will explain for it for you. Look a little young for the senior league, hmm? I keep all my gray hidden under the helmet. Hmm. Ah, good tip. Okay, one second. Right here. Ford Cruller. The greatest psychonaut of all time, and a close personal friend of mine, I might add. Um, they all fought the big bad, which was a big bad, and psychic, and she broke his fucking brain, like, shattered his, her, his brain into, like, a bunch of different personalities. He's fucking nuts. So, I'm trying to fix him. Watch it. This disinfectant spray is lethal. Shouldn't you be wearing a mask? Ah, I've got it in my blood. Hi, kid. Hey, coach. Mm. <clears throat> yeah. Don't don't sleep too hard there. You might fucking fuse a feature so all right. Uh Talk to you I'll later. Leave you to plans. plans that will save your life. Walter. This is the. No, I can't. Don't. Nope, you guys didn't play the first one. Um, I can't say.
guys. Fucking sand night owl. You can't. It's called insomnia. I'll take that card. I have had it since birth. Yeah, well, might as well take Let's some practice shots before the rest of the senior league gets here. Super washout. Aww. Oh. Well, that was demoralizing. All right. Watch it. This e Ford. Jews aren't ready yet. Yeah, well, we're gonna go in your head. What you doing there? Trying to disinfect these bowling shoes. I think I'm losing the fight. Would you mind if I stepped inside your mind for a minute? Sure. Better than you stepping inside one of these shoes. I tell you, it's like Germ City in there. I know, but yeah, exactly. All owls are night owls. Well, not all. Of them. There are ones that hunt in daytime. Germ City. Keep the balls in the lanes, please. No. Sorry. Whoa, stay. Can I talk to yep. you. The couple that came here on the date, Ford and Lucy. Yeah, they were just here a second ago. Cute couple. Any idea where they went? They went bowling. Da ha! That away. Thanks, sir. Rude man. Careful for him. Your face might stick that way. <laughs> Ford? Hmm, wow. Ford and Lucretia dated? Whoa! Okay, it's just like a giant thought bubble. Made of bricks. Catamari! Oh, wow! Oh, shit. Hey, look at that giant Ford head. I wonder if there's any brains in there. More than you got, Sonny. Northern Big Hawkdown. Yeah, 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 that's the one I know. Give it a rest, guys! Death is coming from above! Pick me. I don't think I've seen a pick. Uh, guy was right. All hail Guy the Prophet. Or I've seen the pick in that the hog. Whatever one is in fucking Michigan. Giant or near Michigan. Great smoke and flavor. Listen to Guy. We're all gonna die. Oh, you're asking for it, pal. to fix that rail crane, and you're gonna help me, okay? I think I hear something. Well, that's awesome. You should look up random weird ass facts. What's that sound? Eh, uh, sorry. That's uh, not how these things work. They uh, only polish balls. Man, polish balls. Okay, I didn't know if I could make that happen. Oh, 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 I saved it. That's the stuff. Here we go. This music's great. Yeah, that ball is too slick to ride now. Let's roll. I know what you're up to, kid. You slime is so sticky. You know it. The kids just love it. Do I know the best place to take you all on vacation or what? Yeah! Yay! Not always clear. Ah, uh, thanks. 
Oh shit. Oh! Ah! Look out! Hey! Sorry! Ah! I'll pay for that! Hey! I was in! Excuse me! Please! Coming through! Hey! I know that guy! Hey. Yes. I'm gonna get to Ford. I need to fix that broken I think rail on the they literally Express before someone added, asks me. Or kept that in uh, the Texas State Constitution ever because it's, you know, fucking Texas and everybody has to have a gun at all times and whatever, that's them. Where, I fucking forgot where I was going with this. Shit. No, no, um, but yeah, they're like, okay, since you know that's what? us, we cannot get rid of the duel, it has to stick. It's intrinsic to our fucking state nature, which I kind of agree. Yeah. Wanna keep it? He's a maniac. Cool! Is this stuff? Now, let's lay some track. When the world gets destroyed, I want it to be perfect. Yes. Fix the Kingpin Express. Ready? Thanks for the ride. Shit. Man, this thing's big. I got a heart? Yeah, right. You're afraid. Nah, oh, you're so brave. Why don't you do it? Do 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 Express, coming your way. See, this is why I usually don't open my mouth, because I say stupid shit. <laughs> Just keep under my head, or you'll be sorry. Get to that giant Ford head before the city is sanitized. Ah, no. Yeah. Ah. Right back. Ooh, yes. Just raid our all content. How rude! Shit! 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 Dude, w just wait. I'm almost done with this area. I'm not actually, but there's. Do that again, and you'll just be keep sorry. watching. It gets. Oh. It gets weird. You should feel cynical, you skip all cutscenes and then never watch them ever. Hi. He doesn't enjoy the game. Sorry, I looked at chat and lost my words. Shit. Oh, wow, I, I phased through it. Right time's over, germs. Alright, here's the type dexterity skill here. And also, try to ignore my fear hey, of heights. Hey, everybody! Ella's working again, so don't bother hoofing it upstairs on your own, whatever you do. Well, somebody Thanks. get this kid off hey, our construction site! Oh, come on, L. we talked about this! I'm gonna be a D Tom and Jerry cartoon. Oh god, 
this makes me so fucking nervous for some for some reason. I forgot I could do this. Yes, back in action. Uh, oh shit. elevator now goes all the way to the top. No need to climb up there on your own. In summary, all is well in the world again. Uh, except, of course, that it's ending. And Walker's coming, yeah. Really? You've only played Warrior, huh? Only played warrior, or just that's the only thing you like? Dragoon, throw everyone off. Got one piece of Ford's mind connected. Now for the other two. I hope I'm doing the right thing. But Agent Zanato is right. We'll need Ford at full capacity if we're gonna have a chance against Maligula. Where's his brain frame? In his lab on the other side of the quarry. 
Nice to see you again, Rasputin. And you've managed to stay clothed. Very good. Wow. Look at all these gadgets. Gadgets? Sorry. <coughs> machines. Psycho-reactive technology? Rasputin, I thought you would recognize these for what they are. These are dreams. Where do you think machines come from? They spring forth from the human imagination. They are human thought made real. I invented that one when I was angry. When I designed that one, I was sad. That one, uh, You're fucking weird, I was just hungry. Incredible! Glad you liked it. You know, I'm not supposed to check out equipment to interns, but Agent Nine seems to put a lot of faith in you, my boy. So, if yeah. you'd like to try one out, just let me know. Yep. Hurry up so I can oh, get the brain. Are y'all ready for some Jack Black? You shouldn't be back here. It's let not me Benjamin's house. Uh, yes, <coughs> Sorry. Got any cool devices to lend out? Shh. Interns aren't allowed to check out my devices. Yes, Jack Black but is in here. if you were to take your time, say, delivering one of these to Sasha or Mia, well, that would be none of my business. This one is a thought tuner. Use it to find as as auto is done talking floating here. around the world. And this psi-enhanced camera is for creating oh, photographic yeah. Here's memories. a utility item you could use, and you here is them, useless photo. That would only increase my legal liability. Have fun. Yeah. Uh-huh. And right. thanks for delivering those items to Sasha and Mia. Well, I ought to let you get back to work. Ha-ha! Very, very uh, humorous. Yeah, isn't it? Uh -huh. Anyway, I fucking hate red match. Okay, glad we got that out of the room. Grab this. And... Jack Black. So many brains! All voluntarily donated upon death. I have all the paperwork. Some. These people are all dead? Uh, their bodies are. And their brains are no longer capable of thought. But I've preserved them here, in the brain frame. What for? Experiments. Ew. Really? No room for the squeamish and psychic science, Sonny. The mind is the final frontier of humanity. Only begun to explore its mysteries. That is, after all, the true mission of the psychopaths. Someday, my brain will live here, and yours too. What? Should have read that NDA more carefully. Ha ha ha. 
Ugh. I like the new Machinist, even though I still don't know how to fucking play it, so I can't really give an opinion on it. But, um, I need to go to a different room. Oh shit. To give you guys some context, um, Jack Black here, I'll play. Or else this next bit is gonna feel so fucking out of place. Some things never change, I guess. Where's your fucking thing? You don't have a thing. Is it in here? You better be in fucking this room. Oh, it's right here. Because they should have made Dancer a healer, and they didn't want to admit it. That way they could have made it, you know, do more bumps and just shit like, like that. Okay. So like I said, all these old people fought the big pack, that, the big bad a long time ago, and, well, Almost this guy died during the fight. Helmet Fulbear explored a synthesis of psychic powers and the arts. Sadly, he was lost in the battle of the world. Okay. Come back to the automatic. Many new items in stock. Are we actually getting skill showcases? Someone to use divine ruination or something. Oh, be fun. Okay, here we go. Have the dome, Harry. Hey, this one looks not bad. Not bad at all. Cause of death: abandonment? Question mark. Found in the Hepta Dome. Psychic specialty? Question mark. Release authorized. Both. It is both. Combat, exploration, puzzles. Probably been a long time since you've had a visitor. We hope you don't mind poppins. Alright, I will shut up now. Hmm. Maybe I'm too late. Doesn't seem to be any life left here. Oh, hello. Can you hear me? My name is Raz. Who are you? <laughs> How long have you been in here? What's your name? <laughs> Sorry. Oh, you. Sorry, I just haven't talked in such a long time. Oh my gosh, is that my voice? Is that what I sound like? What do you sound like? Oh my gosh, who are you? Are you not me? My name is Raz. Words. Words. You're saying words to me? <laughs> what was that non-word sound I just made? Am I dying? No, not dying. I feel alive. He is jumping into dead people's brains, yes. Who are you? Who am I? Am I anything? Am I everything? Am I God? Well, I'm not sure, but I feel like I might be God. Or the universe, or the ultimate cosmic oneness, or something in that jam, am I right? Well, basically, right now, you're kind of a brain in a jar. Uh huh? But if you can remember your name, <laughs> we might be able to find out what happened to your body. I can't remember much of anything. Hmm. I believe you are suffering from extreme sensory deprivation. Years with no physical input has caused your memory and identity complexes to atrophy. Oh, I am not ready for words that big yet. Yeah. <laughs> I happen to know of a body that needs a brain right now. 
now to keep it out of trouble. If I were to place you in that body, you would start to receive fresh sensory input, which could trigger some of your lost memories. Let's do it! Wait, what's a body? Aren't we all one? I'll be right back. What? <laughs> Where can you go? This is everything! I promise to be quick. When I'm gone, you try to remember stuff. Okay, but please hurry. I'll try to remember when I created the universe. Or when I destroyed it. Smelling salts. This part's gross. If I put this brain into Nick's body, I think I'd be helping them move out. As well as helping me to get into the mail clerk's private office. Come with me, handsome. Gross. Have brain mood trap. Back to the mail room to put it in Nick's head. By the way, Nick is my mentor, and he is walking around without a fucking brain in his head. I just, I walk right past it. I walked right past you. Jack Black in our body. Scanning access granted. Yep. Oh, hang on. You can see how you uh, look like, through other people's eyes. This is how I look to a rat. Nick, how would you feel about an upgrade to your sense of self-protection? Ooh. It's just get a funnel. Can you hear me? Wall of light. Are you in there? Light, dark, and every flavor in between. But all these colors are just one band in this sensual rainbow of rainbows. What is this room, and how can I taste it all at once? And who composed this symphony? Uh, Nick? One symphony is beautiful, but a hundred all at once? Oh god, I can smell the Big Bang! There's an ant in the wall that's grinding its teeth. Everything is <laughs> oneness. Nothingness. Nothingness! Who says I don't? Nothingness! Is this cashmere? It's too delicious! <laughs> you have problems, I sir. should really go back in there, but I'm just a little scared. Yep. Alright, here we go. Alright, let's see how he... Alright, perfect example. We can see how he, his point of view looks right now. Holy fuck. I am a full spectrum lover! I can see that. Right, that hurts my eyes. Hey, Nick. I've got something here that will <laughs> Sorry. Is it a blindfold? Earplugs? My bad. Better. Oh, I don't know if you want to come in. <laughs> he warned us. Whoa, 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 what the? Ball of light? Are you in here? I'm here. Everything's here. Too many things are here. You're experiencing a sensory overload. Try to stay calm. Whatever you do, don't have a... Panic attack. Uh... I have a heart. My fight or flight response is triggering. I say fight. Fight! How do we get out of here? Stay calm now. Stay calm. Handling <laughs> is so much better than I would be. How do I get here? What's going on? 
I can't breathe. I feel like I'm about to go on stage. You're handling this so much better than I would be. How do we get out of here? You may stay calm, man. Stay calm. I don't want to beat it. It's just too fast. Oh. Dear universe, please um. shut up! I don't want to use it in combat because there I'm we afraid are. I'm gonna get my ass good. <laughs> Let's stay here. I'll try it though. I don't like the looks of these, but I guess they're a sign that he's remembering something. Um, I can tell you one thing. That is the big bad. Hope this is a good memory. Where are we? Shh. It's a quiet place. Oh wait, shit. Here's a question. Heh. <laughs> On stage. Come on, Psy King. Get ready My for colors, place. guys. Psy King? My dark place. sending you all sorts of sensory input. Smells, tastes, visual sounds, tactile feedback. You've just got to deal with it. But we know how to deal with a crowd, man. Speak for yourself. I don't remember a thing. Okay, let's see what... Um, I'm just gonna put this on the fucking... I mean, I'm happy to have an audience again, but... <laughs> I just wish we knew what to do with them. Okay. Maybe they'll go away. Got the first tag. So many colors. I want. I think they you want know, the vision. Face, sounds a lot like my friend Ford. Were you in a band with Ford Color? Ah, uh, good old Vision. He always had such a good eye for, you know, visuals. I see. Well, maybe when your full memory returns. You know what this crowd wants? Yeah, they came for a feast of the senses. So give it to them. Oh, wow, man, it's been so long, I, I, I don't even know what my violin is. What is a feast of the senses? Is it a band? Well, it's more than a band, man. It's a non-stop festival of sights, sounds, smells, feelings, and flavors. That sounds and gross. And yes, it was our old band. Our old friends. Who was in the band? Besides me, there was uh, Tasty, Dr. Touch, Audio, Sniffles, and of course, on the mic, we had the Psy King. What happened to the feast? Well, the audience just disappeared one day. And the band drifted apart. Uh, I'd do anything to get the band back together again. I'll find your violin. Just tell me where you last used it. Can I even remember what it looked like? Uh, 
If only you could see the world the way I see it. Jesus Christ. I thought the inside of an eyeball would be... <laughs> Fucking I look over it and it's it's see whoever did, made this thing yeah. does trucks. Coincidence. <laughs> oh. You, you think, Panda? Look at the fucking mushroom trees. Flowers. Whatever they're called. Listen to the music. Are they hippies? I don't know. What's that? A new friend? No. no. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, that's right. It's that kind of world. Ooh, pretty. Oh, you're gonna get the feels real bad, Carmine. So get fucking used to it. Eyes on the window. Color. Is the bridge. Check one. Check one. Check. Check one. Or is this two? Check. Check. Check one. Check. Check. Sibilance. Sibilance. <laughs> Are you copper bottoming them, my man? No. I'm aluminium them, my man. <laughs> check. 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 Check one, two, check one, two, three. <clears throat> testing, testing. Okay. No, I... I don't want to deal with any of this shit. Whoa! When you're alone as long as I was, time loses some of its meaning, and your perception of it becomes your reality. Wanna give it a try? music rip off. It sounds like the what the fucking Beatles wish they sounded like, I guess. I don't know. I guess a little Star Warsy, but not now. Oh, okay, I gotcha. I've got eyes on the target. And I've got eyes on me. Hi! Sorry if you already saw it, I just think we should be checking in with each 
Senses. That's their band name. Those look dangerous. Let's go somewhere else. <laughs> Sergeant Peppers. <laughs> Lonely Arts Club. That's a good, yeah. Can you There's smell the cigarette smoke from this like song? Like, from the fucking 50 plus here. Sorry, they're all like 80 now. It's all so beautiful. But it's too much. Too many colors. Don't panic. Oh god, panic attack. Oh, great. One second, one second, one second, one second. Where'd he go? He sees me as a scared little boy. Now we know. Much better than I would be. You want me to tie bubble up for you? <laughs> My heart is racing. Do I have a heart? Get out of here. I feel like I'm about to go on stage. My response is triggering. Oh, thank you. I don't know what got into me. Taste the brown ass. <laughs> Once we get these light ticklers hooked up, the stage show is going to be incredible. Oh. How do you feel about this game, Carmen? Oh shit, emotional baggage. Shit! Dude, that's great. 
Doesn't anyone here just want to sit? I don't like the look of that thing. I think you like that a little too much, if you ask me. The Why first one came out on it's been a while. Xbox. You can get it on PC. On Steam, for 10 bucks. Which I probably recommend you do. That way, oh god. Hey! Nope, I tried. Well. I'm so smooth that, you know, no, you have to play it. You cannot look up a plot somewhere. You have to. There's playing it isn't, is crucial to this. It's an experience. Have you guys ever tried to say yes? Me work. Don't tell Vision I said this, but eyeballs are kind of gross. If you look at them closely, I already feel horrible for saying that. <laughs> oh, I know this one. This is a blender, right? Well, this is a strange way to use a blender. Oh, you're right, it's a lamp. A lamp for making drinks. Dude, I don't care about the squiggles. I'll come back for the squiggles. I don't give a shit right now. I care about heart containers. You guys, stay away from my friend here. I don't want to get Yeah. <laughs> 
He's fucking killing it. Well, and it's better, but to handle a crowd that size, we need the whole band, man. We need Tasty, Sniffles, Dr. Touch, and Audie. Yeah, Audio. You'll remember him, man. <laughs> Where are they all now? Oh, they wandered off when the audience left. Could be anywhere. This festival covers so many acres. Hey! <laughs> Didn't we used to have a cool band van? Feel Oh my god. I'll bet they're still at the festival somewhere. Woohoo! So what's driving? Whoops. You want me to drive? I don't want to brag, but uh, I've got some uh, eyes. <laughs> oh, let's try the concession. These are the concession stands. If they got hungry, they'll good idea. Let's look here. Here's where the game gets trippy. So many flavors. Trippier. And lines, man. So many long lines. I'll go find Tasty and Sniffles. for more drugs excuse me hang on kid we're trying to decide what to order you can eat after the show vision and psy king are waiting by the van what psy king is back let's get our instruments we've been in this line for so long i'm not even sure where they are you guys let me take a look I'll bet I can find them. Oh, Tasty, I can't decide. Well... So that happened. Maybe I can find their instruments before they make up their minds. I swear I can taste this thing. I bet you fucking can. I have to admit, I'm a little afraid of this one. <laughs> Tongues and boogers? <laughs> That's all just part of being in a band, man. I'm fine. Wait, don't do that. I'd go flying like a racket ball. Oh, let's see how he 
sees us now because he has eyes. Almost had it. I just need to focus a little longer. With Still the same. Points. This smells like the way across. Sorry. Say what you will about the tongue, but it's a very sensitive and capable organ. Gross. To be honest, this is more tongue than I would prefer. Here's the steamer trunk tag. All right, have a good night, man. Ah, peace and quiet again. How nice. So many people eat without really tasting. Such a shame. Dude, I know. My instincts it's are so telling fun. me not to hold this thing too long. Oh. Why do all these creeps say I can taste you? I want to know what you taste like. Not really. You taste like shoes. But no one's. What's that smell? <gasps> Oh God, it's my own sweat. Hey, hey, don't. I can smell my own sweat. You're not supposed to be able to do that, are you? Oh God, now I can taste it. Oh, I... Well, I didn't 
best not see that coming. Those people just don't appreciate flavor. But I loved it. Ooh, that's a good look on you, Psy King. We need to get the whole band back together. Am I right? We need Dr. Touch. And we need audio. I need time to practice my mix. Yeah, where are they? I could really use a drink. Ever heard the psychic sing? He is amazing. He's the best. Oh, please, you're making me blush. Hey, how are you, Bala? I mean, psychic. I'm a little overwhelmed, but you know, too much sense is better than none, right? I'm basically this band's manager, since none of you are any good at multitasking. Let's go somewhere else. Everybody, back in the van. Can't beat that old van smell. Where are we going? They might have wandered into the campgrounds, it's true. Ooh, our promoter's not gonna like that. Good idea. Let's look here. Well, this is the campground. Dr. Touch and Artie used to like to come here. They like to get high out here. So, you're saying they're up there? Yep. The view up there is amazing. I've heard about music festivals like this. This one is surprisingly clean.
always do. No, we don't. See? You. Didn't you guys see the huge crowd down there? People are screaming for the Feast of the Senses. That's what I've been telling this one. But the problem with him is that he just won't listen. Without Psyking, there is no feast. There's nothing. But Psyking is back. What? He's down by the van with Vision. But we're not ready. We haven't practiced. Dr. Touch, where are our instruments? I, I thought you had them. Let me take a look. I bet I can find them. Sounds good to me. Let me give you a hand.
feeling better. I'm ready to help. Hey, where'd he go? I gotta say, Saking, you're almost looking like your old self again. I'm sorry I abandoned the band, you guys. Hey, it's gonna make for a better rockumentary someday. Time for the feast. Feast! Just a thought is all I've got Now my cover's blown At the bottom of a lake Of frozen feeling When my friends pulled me back up I started healing Plan to defeat Maligula.
You were going to act her to death? I did a monologue about Lucy's life and what she meant to us. To try and bring her back. I was useless that day. You think you were useless that day? I tried to stop her with a motivational speech. Actually, Fulbert, you distracted her long enough that I was able to recruit some local animals to help. Which also didn't work. We all brought what we had to the battle. The main thing was, your beautiful performance did bring out the old Lucy. Just for a bit. It reminded us that she was in there. So, Maligula used to be... your friend? And her name was... Lucy? <sighs> Was she the seventh member of the Psychic Six? Lucretia Mux, but she went bad somehow and then you all had to go fight your friend? I liked not remembering stuff. I'm learning a lot. Yeah, me too. You guys! I'm right here! Where are you going? Why did you all abandon me for a thousand years? Twenty. Maybe in your world? Did they even look for me? Did they all forget I existed? We did look for you, fool bear. But my stupid hyper high glaciator there, which we brought to freeze Maligula, well, it, uh... It worked as designed, Otto. You were so deep in that frozen lake, we couldn't find you. No matter how much we duck. I know you're just speculating here, Helmet. I think you're probably right. But I sent you my brain, Ford. Didn't you find it? I... I don't know. Ford must have brought your brain back because I found it in Otto's lab. But he must have lost that memory when his mind was shattered in the battle. That brain was shattered? Well, come on. There was a little crack to begin with. My body's been in hyper ice all this time. I'll bet I look amazing. Almost done. I'm starting to enjoy it now. where that monster drowned my Bobby. Because I failed. Because my stupid plan couldn't save him. No, you saved me. You threw yourself into the path of danger, sacrificing yourself to save me. Rather dramatically, I might add. Well, I mean, thank you. So, I'm not dead. I'm out there somewhere waiting for you to come back to me. I'm coming to you, right now. I swear. Better hurry. You know how I get. Memories, my boy. Just a show we put on inside our heads. Sometimes the first draft of the script stinks. Thanks for helping me with the rewrites. Now let's go give the people what they want. <laughs> Everybody stand back. Remember, this is our friend, Lucy. She's going through a tough time. I think she might just need someone to listen to her. Save your sympathy for your strawberry, Donato.
loved it. Do it again. Perfect. One last curtain call and the show's over. I haven't found your body yet, Forbear. But not to worry. I've got your brain, and I'm going to keep it safe back at HQ. And come back for the rest of you. Just after I figure out what to do with Lucy. Okay. I know you won't forget about me. I don't think anybody's gonna forget about you after that performance. In fact, I think they're demanding an encore. Senior staff only. I'm... Who am I again? Nick John Smith. Nick John Smith, senior mailroom staff. Welcome. Helmet Fulbear, deceased. About time they sent me an assistant. Ford's gonna be so excited when he figures out who you really are, Agent Fulbear. Everybody is. Kid, I owed you one. And now we're square. But I'm not ready to face Crawler. Not until I talk to Bob. But... Lots of baggage to unpack. You wouldn't understand. But please, tell no one of my return. But... I'll see you at curtain call! Oh, somebody shut that door before the wind blows all my letters away! See this in the physical world. What a strange place.
God damn it. That is some shit. Side pouch isn't big enough to hold it. I should get a bigger pouch for automatic. 